Media. I'm Marcus Bradley Hardy, and today is Friday, January 7th. And we're here to bring you news about the new semester, National Supreme Day, and a special segment. Now here's Ms. Bondo with the information about the new semester. We expect our students to, you know, return with a positive attitude and to keep doing all the great work that we've seen in the fall and to just like, keep on, you know, a good path and make sure that they're doing everything that they need to do to be successful. So if a student needs attendance recovery, you'll get an email from me for sure. Uh, and uh, your parent will get one as well. And it'll have, it'll tell you like, hey, you know, you're over. Here's where you're over. And it'll tell you how to calculate how many hours you need. Now for attendance recovery to actually do it, you have to qualify for it. So you have to be over the amount of absences. And you can either do tutoring with any teacher on your schedule. Or you can do the virtual AR, which is on the homework helpline. So traditionally what we've done is that you have to have, I believe, an 80 or better in the class. So that's looking at your report card grades up to that point. And also it's three or less absences in the class. And the absences that don't count are anything school business or health absences. This past Wednesday was National Whipped Cream Day. Here's Ms. McCarthy and how she celebrates it. You know, I love to celebrate National Whipped Cream Day by having some <laughs> <laughs> whipped cream. Delicious. Hey everyone, my name is Bella Galan and we're here out in the halls to ask y'all about y'all's 2022 New Year's resolutions. Let's get to it. My name is Leah Rangel and my goals for 2022 is to be kind to everybody and be grateful for all I have. JPO here and I'm hoping this year to make healthier choices as far as diet and exercise goes. I'm Jaden Sanchez and my New Year's resolution for 2022 is to hang out with my friends more. Hi, I'm Melissa Carl. My hopes for 2022 is to not spend all my money on albums. My name is Chris Law, and my New Year's resolution is to keep a 90 average. Uh, my name is Hunter Alt, and my New Year's resolution is to um, not fail Spanish class and inform people on the dangers of communism. Hi, my name is Joy. I'm the vice president of the book club, and my New Year's resolution for 2022 is to wake up earlier, get more stuff done, and to learn to play the piano. Hi, my name is Alex, and my New Year's resolution for 2022 is to actually graduate. Hi, I'm Mr. Rocha, and I teach AB2, and my New Year's resolution is to go to the gym. Hi, my name is Ms. Frias, and I have two New Year's resolutions. One is to eat less candy, and the other is to try to find a little bit of a better work-life balance. My name is Ms. Cody. I'm the attendance secretary. My New Year's resolution is to eat better. Hi, I am Dr. Baker, proud principal of Communications Arts High School, and my New Year's resolution this year is to talk less and listen more. Hi, my name is Ms. Skidmore. I'm your counselor, and my New Year's resolution is to learn to cook with a hot pot. Hi, I'm Mr. Alisea. I'm the associate principal here at ComArts, and in 2022, um, I just want to get a little bit healthier, lose some weight, and get a little bit more active. Thank you so much. Those are amazing resolutions. I hope you have an amazing 2022. Don't forget to follow our socials. We have the best students in the district, and we believe that ComArts students will be confident, capable, and communicative leaders. Go out and make good choices and be the leaders of tomorrow. I'm Keisha Velasco, and this has been ComArts Media.